All right, so let's do this problem. And they want us to solve for what? Hey. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, just like when we were solving before, the main important thing is let's actually go through a very easy problem, and I'll explain it, and then I'll try to relate it to this one. Let's pretend we have x equals 3 plus 2y. Two, two okay? Let's look at x for the sign of x. Let's do, um, let's do 11. Okay. If I would ask you to solve this problem for y, your main goal, right, is to get y by itself. So the first thing we do is we undo addition and subtraction. So we say, what is being added to our variable? Well, you can say that's a 3 is being added because it's a positive 3. So we subtract the 3 on both sides, and we get 8 equals 2y. Then what else is happening to the variable that's preventing it from being by itself is being multiplied by 2. So to undo multiplication, we divide by 2. So you get 4 equals y. Now my variable is by itself. I've solved for it, which we can just rewrite y equals 4. Cool? You guys follow me with this? <laughs> just That's just random steps. This looks crazy, but guess what? It's the exact same thing. What are we trying to solve for? H, H right? First thing we do, undo addition and subtraction. What is being added to the H? That's all multiply, multiply, multiply. That's a plus plus, that's a plus, but all this stuff is positive, so all of this is being added. All of this is being added to your h, so to undo that, I need to subtract 2 pi r squared. And I do that on both sides. And this is where a lot of students get confused, because they like 11 minus 3 equals 8. They understand that. a minus 2 pi r squared, you can't combine them, they're not like terms. So we're just going to leave it as a minus 2 pi r squared equals what's left over, 2 pi rh. Now we say what's happening to our variable. It's being multiplied, right? It's being multiplied by 2 pi r. So we're going to divide by 2 pi r. So therefore I have h equals a minus 2 pi r squared divided by 2 pi pi r. All right? Mm -hmm. And we could separate that. I'm going to leave the answer um, just like in that form. Okay? That's it.